Restore Humanity is fighting for the concept of globalizing your heart. Meaning that we want you to open, we want every person to open up their hearts to the human family because we're all in the same family. We want people to be moved if a baby dies in Ethiopia, just as moved as they are if a baby dies two towns over. We just need to feel that pain of people in the world and feel compassion for them. And I truly believe once we become aware and once we use that pain and compassion to be inspired to help, as everyone can help in all different kinds of ways. The apartheid government came into power in 1948. Apartheid specifically uh, translates into apartness. They were worried that white people were losing that um, in terms of privilege and position. I worked at a preschool, a children's home, and I worked with hospice. I worked with AIDS orphans and patients. Uh, but the problems were just completely overwhelming. The apartheid government, in terms of accountability, they built a system that put people at the bottom of society. And you can't undo that in 10 or 12 or 13 years. You, you can't do that in, undo that in a generation, I don't think. We have to remember that the South Africa that we know today was born in 1994. And so it's a 13-year-old country, and we can't expect it to have um, just completely disconnected from what had led up to 1994. Many become discouraged at the enormous problems plaguing people all over the world. However, the more we become educated and we become aware, we should stand up and help, not shy away in fear. Abraham Lincoln said, we, even we here, hold the power and bear the responsibility. I don't you heartily agree. Why? One blood, one people, one purpose.